so um, I did stop the Sherpa's tablets. I was hoping that... <laughs> Hello, buddy. Hold on, then. I was hoping that his limp would go for more natural things, but his limp seems to have got worse since I've stopped the tablets. I didn't want him being on, like, four tablets a day. Uh, but I've ordered some more now because I'm going to have to put him back on them because he is limping a lot more without the tablets now. So I've got to pick them up on Monday. Um, going to head to the the horse field, the, the moors in a bit, and see how we get on there. I'm not really looking forward to it, but I thought we'd pop over there. Also, see what I mean about his limp. Also, Sherpa had one of his funny turns again last night, and I'll, I'll show you that as well. Um, don't worry, he, he's had them since he was about, uh, I'd say about two years old. I remember him having the first one, and he had one again last night. And basically, I, I've no idea what it is. The vets have got no idea what it is. But he will stand and walk very slowly, and he'll he'll just wander around, and he'll he'll look left and right. Um, and he, he just doesn't seem with it. But then, as soon as you offer him some food or something, he'll be completely with it. But something seems to take his attention. I don't know what it is. Um, but yeah, I, I don't know if it's like a mini stroke that he has or um, just no idea at all. It's, it's not really got any worse as he's got older. And he usually has about one a year. And I don't think he's had one in the caravan yet. Or he might have just had one, so... He was G1, <laughs> not that I like him to have any at all, but yeah, I'll, I'll show you I'll show you what happens anyway, because I did record it. Oh, and a van update as well. Uh, <laughs> so it's been over two weeks now, and I should be getting it back Monday or Tuesday. What happened was <laughs> um, the, the garage that broke the glow plug, they had to send it to another garage to get them to get the glow plug back out again because it wasn't one of their specialities. Uh, so they sent the van over there. And then once the van got there, the people couldn't do it because they needed the bumpers and the lights and the radiators to all taken out. And that certain garage doesn't deal with things like that. So then we had to lorry it back to this normal garage to have everything taken off of it and then ship it back again to the engine garage. It was a complete and utter pain in the backside. But I looked on the tracker last night and it's actually returned to the original garage. So we've got all these shipping costs as well, which is going to be a pain. But at least... Sherp, this way. Sheep over there. Good boy. Damn, he's good. Um, but yeah, at least it's back at the original garage now. So the engine's all been done and they just need to put it all back together again now. So fingers crossed, Monday, Tuesday, we should have the van back. <laughs> oh, it's been so long. So it looks like a beautiful day out today and we're gonna um, head to the moors and hopefully not come across any horses. We've not been there for a week. You up for a moors wander? You alright, buddy? <laughs> There's the horses there, and we've got past them. It is really nerve wracking, um, but Sherp's completely fine. He's running around absolutely fine. He does, but we're sort of walking by the road bit, so there's a fence we can jump over if we need to. <laughs> so, but yeah, so far, it's um, it's okay. But yeah, I'm very nervous. But yeah. You happy to be back? You happy boy? They're over there, don't worry. All the way over there. Looks like there's been a digger here or something and they've cleared a bit of the moors. Not sure why they would have done that. Very weird. <laughs> okay, you're safe buddy. Can't see them. 
They're going to hear you. <coughs> they will. That's why we're trying to be quiet. <coughs> <laughs> You're not going to help, are you? <coughs> <laughs> oh, the horses are coming. I'm, I'm kidding. <laughs> Are you scared then? <laughs> right, should we keep going? Let's go, okay. So hot today, I could have wore shorts today, I wish I had. But it's such a hot day today. Isn't it? Happy? Good. <laughs> okay, so far so good. Can't see him anywhere, Sheps. Right. right, I'll show you what we brought with us today. Just to make us a bit safer, just in case. The same happens happened last time. I bought myself a little bag. A little tiny little bag. There we go. But what we got inside this bag is some spray. I mean, it will probably never happen again. Oh, in my pocket as well. I always carry this torch anyway, but this has got a, um, a like a flasher on it, so that might help. Also, what we've got here is what Sherp just isn't worried about at all, is... Oh, you heard it that time. <laughs> it's an alarm. <laughs> I see, but I think... Uh, the two things I'm most confident with, if uh, if we were to get an attacked by a horse again, is this bad boy. I reckon that would keep him away. Do you not think? I definitely, definitely think that would help. Do you think, Chips? And the other thing that we've got is the thing that saved our life last time. We have a new umbrella. <laughs> Still in the packet as well. Look. So the other one was so good. We bought exactly the same one. And uh, yeah, that is the lifesaver. So we've got that as well. Also got some of this. I don't think that's going to do anything, but you never know. <laughs> I think we're being overly cautious. <laughs> and if all fails, um, we've been assured by Bat Dog that if we show them this, then uh, that's his spare one, of course. He's got one. If we show them that, then the horses will run a mile because they'll think their bat dog's coming. Not that Sherpa looks anything like bat dog, but they'll still think, you know, they'll see the symbol and they'll be scared for their lives and they'll run. So, yeah. Are you feeling confident? <coughs> yeah? So you can't see him. <coughs> can't see him anywhere. <coughs> So hopefully, we'll be all right. You're going to get him this time. No, you're not. You're going to stay. Away. Why do you keep saying I know? Why do you keep saying I know? You know what? You know what? You're being weird. <laughs> That's better. <laughs> Good boy. <laughs> so yeah, for those of you who don't know, the last time we did come here. It was about a week ago, and uh, we got attacked by a horse. And the, it probably lasted about seven minutes, um, something like that. And yeah, it was very, very scary. So we bought a few things just to help us out this time, just in case. <laughs> Hopefully it won't happen again, but we've stayed away for a week and we thought, no, we need to get back here. So at least we're prepared. In a dog. Go on then. <laughs> oh, nice. Oh, nice.
Fazer 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 Last one, Fazer So getting up here, so hopefully uh, the horses are all over there. Oh dear. <laughs> Loads of coves there. Hold on chaps. Okay, so the problem we've got at the moment is we've got the cows are all there. The entrance is up there. There's more cows there. And there's horses there. I'm sure the horse that got us is the black and white one. It's got a black head, white body, and then black back of the body. So, um, we could try and make a beeline through there and up there. But I'm going to wait till these cows get a bit closer and see which way they're going. <laughs> God's sake. <laughs> It's totally ruined this for us, this place. So, you know, if they're coming down this way, if they're coming down this way, what we'll do is we'll walk around the lake and then back up that way. I think that's what they're doing, they're coming downwards. Um, yeah. Hold on. Shepherd. I don't know how good you'll be in it, covert. Right. Okay. I'll walk around this bit without these cows and horses seeing us. Let's go this way. I feel like we're in a zombie film or something. There's um, the horses over there. And the cows are over there and I want to try and get through this line here um, but yeah generally I'm <laughs> really worried <laughs> um, hopefully those cows are walking more towards the lake I think they are Ready? Okay, so we're past the cows. They're there. I think we've got away with that. There they are. It's five in the morning. You've been up for four hours. And now look at you. Eh? You can't place the name.
pack of knives. <laughs> Gonna give a final high five to Uncle Brian. Yeah.